Trudy, uh, it's half eleven in the morning, the sun's out, another great day for the Orsa Show. It looks superb this year, um, I think it was a, a cool start and it's just coming through now with the sun and it looks set for a brilliant day, hope that means we'll have lots of people coming here and enjoying this wonderful um, displays that we've got on in the Grand Ring, we've got horses, we've got animals, we've got the craft tents, we've got lots of things to buy and refreshments, it's just a lovely day out for everyone, I think it's a, a huge credit to all the people who give their time to organise all of this for the whole year really coming round um, and it, it goes on for year after year, it's terrific. There's an amazing amount of organisation must go into being a bit like a swan the Orson Show isn't it, how calm it seems to be. That's a very good point, all that paddling uh, that goes on, I've been along this year to um, several of the council meetings where they all organise things and the attention to detail and the commitment um, and everything and the surprises that happen on the day that you have to deal with is all done brilliantly with the team, it's, it's a great credit to everyone. The other side that I think is really important is our sponsorship um, because that's absolutely vital, without the sponsorship from a range of local businesses and individuals, the show could never carry on. So we've got volunteers and sponsorship and the people turning up and participating, that's the, the team effort. Because it, there's something quintessentially English uh, about the whole Orson show, about tradition and history, isn't there? Yes, it's tradition, and there's lots of things here that have been here since, what, 1895, in a way, the animals, for that sort of thing. Um, but actually, it's all evolved, and the great thing is that you keep that tradition, but you have you innovate, and you have new things every year. I mean, the helicopter we can hear above us, for example, um, and lots of things for the children. Um, and I think that's terrific, because that's really the, the stability, but change all the time. But of course, it's a risky business. If you have a rainy day, you don't get the people coming through the gate, you lose a lot of money so it needs people with verve and enthusiasm and that's what we've got but we need all the support we can get and I do hope people will come along every year. Trudy.